G'day mobile gaming fans, it's Michael Raw from Raw Raps here yet again with another game review, this time an arcade game review and this time what I think is probably going to be a viral game this game, Wacky Stars. So remember kids, a quick game's a good game so get out into nature and limit your screen time and don't forget to check out my Gamer Cord t-shirts on Teespring. Wacky Stars, so I was asked to review this uh, by the dev team, I got involved uh, with them a little bit before they launched this back in September, well, earlier in September, not that long ago actually, a few weeks ago, or was it last week, one and two, not too long ago, and uh, they've actually worked really hard on this game, I think it's quite a really well polished game, and banks off the uh, Helix Jump gameplay, I'm just going to jump straight in. So it's basically a multiplayer version of Helix Jump, and what a great idea, you know? So you've got little portals that you can go down. The name of the game is to get to the bottom before the others. There's a portal that sort of sneaks you through, and I'm actually not, haven't been going that well. I've won one, and I've come third once and then last pretty much every other time, <laughs> I don't know. I didn't think I was that bad at Helix Jump, but anyway. And as you know, you know, once Helix Jump came out, there was so many different um, copies of it. Reverse engineered Helix games, so with this style of gameplay. So this is the game hook basically, is the spiralling down, which is really cool. And the fact they've made it multiplayer is is really unique. I think a great idea. Why wouldn't you? When they first uh, told me about this, I thought, wow, what a great idea this was. So just a reverse engineered um, on that that Helix gameplay. So I've come last again. Jeez, I want to show you how good I am. Anyway, that that's my character, but you can actually um, unlock other ones. I'll just put that up there. So you can actually unlock, and you can actually um, upgrade yours. So you decrease your, um, so stronger gravity does not stick to glue. So the more gravity setting you have in your character, um, the, the better you're going to progress through the game. Obviously you've got uh, different characters here. You can get and unlock, which are pretty cool. The in-app currency is coins and you collect them along the way. Actually, I'll just put that there. So we got Astro, Ice Fox, Mummy, Bear, Ducky, Cookie Man, and then Wacky Character. Oh, character. You can actually now then um, add hats, skins, trails. I actually haven't figured out how to do that. I don't know if you can. Oh yeah, there it is. So you just, you can unlock that for your in-app currency. And you can have different poses when you win, I think, isn't it? Yeah, pretty cool. So, lots of unlockables here. Um, In-app currency is fully collecting, so you can't buy the coins at this point. So maybe that might be an addition where you can actually purchase coins as another added in-app current uh, in-app. Um, well, it's an in-app purchase, but a revenue stream for this game because at the moment. Probably don't have a huge amount of revenue streams, and I haven't really seen any ads, so I'm not too sure how they're going to make money on this game. Um, maybe that's coming up in a, d a different version, um, and maybe they're, they're focused on the gameplay, which is a refreshing thing to see. So I'm going to play someone here. This could take a while. So you've got to have an internet uh, connection for this. Or cellular, obviously. And there's a count down there. Straight into the portal. But again, I'm going to get beaten, I think. It's not a defeatist attitude that I've got, but I think I'm going alright, but then they just pass me. Ah. I 
I was coming first then. Oh, was I? I was going alright. See, that's where you're going to collect the coins. As you can see, it's pretty addictive and it, and it hooks you in because you want to um, obviously beat the other players. And the sounds are pretty cool too. I'll include some gameplay with the sound. Go, 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 go. Oh, I was nearly going to win that. Ah, oh, came second. I would have won that. I would have had it on video. <laughs> anyway. Well done, Jax Jaguar. I nearly got it. Pogo the pigeon, rain the rabbit. I beat you. So there you have it, that's the gameplay and as you can see, really addictive and I've got 40 coins so I can actually nearly unlock a box and I guess that free box slot goes there and I guess you can have multiple characters. I'm not too sure what that means yet so we'll just figure that out, that might be an upgrade. I'm actually not too sure what that is. So I've got 101 coins, now I can... I can increase the gravity on him so he goes down quicker. So let's have a quick game of that. Oh, go back and play. Let's see what happens. So yeah, um, graphics, amazing. Uh, I think they're really pro quality graphics. The game hook is tried and tested, but what they've done is reverse engineered a, a multiplayer version of this game. I think it's a great idea. No leaderboards yet that I can see and the actual monetization of this app probably from a developer point of view needs a bit of work because they're not, I don't see how they're going to make a lot of money on it. But again, obviously revenue is important if you're a game company making games, well, and for anyone really, um, because you want to see the fruits of your labor, but maybe they're just going to bring that out in other versions. Uh, because they're concentrating on the actual gameplay, which is really good. Ah, oh, come on. Um, and there's, and you know, at the moment, there's only this one level, so... I don't know if they're gonna... Oh, come on. I'm in the lead. No, I'm not. I'm coming second. Okay, let's try again here with the upgrade. Uh, the graphics are amazing. I think that the platform, they can really expand in, uh, um, in updated versions. I think that, um, you know, they could add so many different elements and colors and characters and so many different things. And probably by engaging their user base to, um, to come up with some different things that they could, um, potentially add into this game. I think, um, not too sure about the longevity of this game given the game hook um, has already been around a little while. So that's probably the only concern. They'd probably have to really try to mix it up, change it up, add um, add value where they can. But they'll probably get a little, little while out of this as far as gameplay goes. And I think I'm in the lead. Oh, don't get complacent. Oh, how'd they do that? Come on. Oh, no, I'm about to shock her. I'm not going to
anyway, so um, love the uh, unlockables, love the concept of the game, love the name, Wacky Stars, it's good. They've had about 10,000 downloads, came out in September. Um, you can see them on all sorts of social media. Um, Wacky Stars is on the fa they've got a Facebook page you can actually add comments to. Uh, again, the, the characters are cool. Uh, going into settings, you can turn on and off audio and change the sensitivity of your controls. Um, and give them some feedback. So what, what they probably need to add in is actually up here where you press on the coin, you know, you can purchase coins and then upgrade your your characters to, so that the sort of um, more tried and tested um, in-app purchase model, I suppose you could, you could say, so they need to add that in. But yeah, I think this has potential to go viral and I think it has the potential to be a really, really hit game. Um, you know, time will tell, but yeah, it's it's got all the elements of a, of a very viral game. So well done to the dev team and definitely recommend this to, to play. Um, good for kids, you know, it's very, a bit of harmless fun, good good uh, competition between friends and things like that. So, yep, definitely want to check out. Remember kids, the quick games are good games, so get out into nature and limit your screen time. Don't forget to check out Gamer Core on Teespring. And stay tuned for uh, another review another couple of indie game reviews coming up so stay tuned thanks for watching and please subscribe